Hey butterflies, it's your girl Pam. I am here today. We're going to talk about something that has been on my mind. I shared with the Ditch and the Debt ladies and I want to share it with you guys. I went and charged on my Home Depot card. I don't know. I'm a, I guess it's one of the videos I did back last year. Um, it was one of the videos that I cut up all my credit cards and that was the one I was struggling with the most. I was scared to get rid of it. So what I did was I went on, cut it up, but I didn't close it. So I charged only $50, but because it's no longer in my bill pay because it was completely paid off, and my email address where I have all my statements go to, I wasn't looking for it. Forgot about the charge. One, two, three, three months later. I don't know, I was looking for something else in that particular, um, I guess, email and realized that I had not paid that bill. Guess what? It was $168, I think, somewhere in that area. And money had gotten a little tight, so I probably wasn't looking for anything either. Um, and so that $50 charge turned into $168. I called and I begged and pleaded with these people. They were kind enough, and don't get me wrong, they didn't have to do anything, but they were kind enough to um, take off one of the late fees and some interest fees for one month. But I was like, ma'am, that's still $127. I said, uh, that's double plus what I charge. So I asked to speak to a supervisor. And the supervisor was, she was helpful, she was nice, she was like, ma'am, this is all we can do. She said, we, it was not a bank error. And what we do is just keep it across the board. If we, you know, give a reduction in anything, we only do one month. So that $50 charge ended up costing me $127. I felt that baby. I paid it off. I was mad. Y'all don't understand how mad I was. <laughs> I was really, really mad. I was mad at myself. It wasn't anybody else's fault. It was my fault. I should have never charged on it. And <clears throat> probably at that particular time, had the money for it, but just trying to make sure that, you know how they tell you to charge something on it and pay it off. And I don't know, it was probably a combination of one or two things throughout that three months. It was probably originally forgot, okay? That, because it wasn't on my bill pay, and probably by the time I remembered, maybe money was tight, whatever it was, I promise y'all, will not, will not do that again. So I just want you guys to know that if you pay off these credit cards, just stop using them. Just cut them up, close the account. It's going to be okay. Whatever you need. You know, I'm I'm a believer. I just believe that God will provide for it and make a way. Um, so I have not closed the account yet. I'm not sure why. So you guys try to help me, but I will not charge on it anymore. I know that for sure. Um, but I think I'm going to do another video because I canceled my American Home Shield which is insurance for your interior um, appliances. So I think I'm going to do another video on that. Maybe that'll be part two because that's probably why I haven't canceled my Home Depot card. It's because I'm a little scared. So leave your comments below. Give a girl a shout out. <laughs> Let me know that, you know, there's some encouragement out here somehow. Um, don't forget if you guys have some, you know, financial wins, you know, leave them down there. I want to get shout you guys out. And don't forget about ditching the debt. Definitely on the Facebook group, have some wonderful supportive ladies over there and some guys. I looked and there was some guys. I was like, okay, good. So, um, 
you know, I want you guys to be as supported and as I feel, because I feel supported. Um, I was relaxing. I hope you guys like my new hair. My baby did my hair. She restarted um, beauty school back in September. So went yesterday, let her cut it and do some dye so mama can be fly. <laughs> so I hope you guys love my hair. Thank you, Brie. Mwah, 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 for mommy. Um, <clears throat> so, you know, I'm... I was really tired, but I made you guys a promise that we were going to have um, our Sunday financial sit down. So this is the first one. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. And let me know what you think at the bottom. And until next time, butterflies, love you.